Lost! 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 The men and women trained to safeguard 330 schools, a move welcomed by pupils. You cannot trust people these days because of they stealing children and taking things at school so we can learn. So, but if the patrollers are here, we are safe. The timing of the initiative has been questioned. A memorial service was held for murdered teen Louise Duval yesterday. She was abducted meters from her school and later killed. The department says its action isn't in response to Duval's murder or the attempted abduction of another girl. We've taken a decision to launch it now because we feel that we already have critical mass in almost 400 schools. These patrollers will move into what has been termed as high-risk schools that will beef up existing security and monitor the movement of children. But they will have little control over what happens outside these gates. And authorities acknowledge they're not doing nearly enough. They have not been prioritizing it. They thought, you know, when learners, they go in groups. They are safe. But now we've discovered that you are no longer even safe even if you are in groups. So it's one of the priority things that as they sit in their joint meetings, they will put it as one of the priority uh, areas that they need also to focus on, especially in protecting our learners as they go to school. The number of patrollers is expected to increase to 6,000 by next year. Chris Alda Lewis, SABC News, Johannesburg.